All condensing boilers produce condensate as a waste product. Now there are a number of different options available to the installer as to how to dispose of this condensate. Now in this particular installation, the installer has chosen to run the condensate externally, which is fine. Um, however, during cold winter months, of course, there is a risk that this condensate could freeze. Now, if the condensate does freeze, that could potentially cause you a problem with your boiler, such as an EA code, a D5 code, or some form of gurgling from the boiler. That would, of course, stop your boiler from working. Now, if that does happen, what you need to do is take one of three steps. The first option available to defrost the pipe would be to get a hot water bottle and to put that onto the affected area of the pipe and allow it to defrost over a period of time. The second option is to go out and purchase some kind of a heat wrap, very similar to the heat wraps that you use for some kind of a, a muscular pain, uh, which would be available from your, from your pharmacy. The third and most effective option is to pour some warm water over the frozen part of the pipe. Now, please make sure you're only using warm water and not boiling water. Um, also, please don't attempt to do this if the condensate pipe has been installed above ground level. All you'd need to do is pour your warm water up and down the pipe to defrost it. Once you reset your boiler um, and you've got it up and running and working, um, we would still recommend, of course, that you get your installer back to insulate the pipe um, to stop it from freezing again in the future.